Brennan from Tech Boys Ireland. Today we have the Kimifon wireless microphone um, wireless transmission, works automatically, strong anti interference capacity, new wireless 2.4 gig mini wireless microphone. A couple of bits of information there at the moment, and I suppose it's asking me what I can actually use it for application equipment, trolley active speaker teaching equipment, mixer, home theater, computer. It doesn't actually say you can use it on a smartphone, but you can actually use it again on a smartphone. And in essence, the first thing that catches my attention is the 2.4 gig. We're all used to Bluetooth um, connections there at the moment, but the 2.4 audio increases the range that you could normally have that you'd expect. Um, in this situation, there's no pairing involved. It is a known frequency there at the moment. So from a security point of view, when you're doing the longer range, it can't be picked up, um, etc. And you don't really get the interference. So obviously the quality is there as well. So that's just 2.4 to be, be, be aware of that much. What do you actually get in the box itself? Comes with, I suppose, the main part is the receiver. So if you're gonna send a signal from one particular place to the other, you need a receiver. You also need a transmitter. So they're probably the, the basic parts that you, of the shell that you actually need. You also need a microphone. So in essence, what you're doing is plugging the microphone into the transmitter, into the receiver, into your amplifier, for example. And that's in essence. This little gadget here on top pulls off. It's actually a wind. Um, so I notice when you're out and about a wind form too, um, there's a big difference if you're out and about getting lots of interference. Watching the news, for example, you'll always see the big there on that. You also get another a variety of accessories. You get this particular mic, which you'd often see on a, a lecturer, for example. You just clip it onto your shirt collar, for example, and you put it on and it'll work in your way. If you're in the gym, for example, that would fall off very quickly. So if you were given a, an exercise class, which I obviously won't be doing today, comes with this particular option so you just put this around your head and it goes this clips off just a bit of protection there at the moment 3.5 mil jack there as well so when you just plug it in as normal you carry it around um, and you can bounce around a lot this is very very stable and um, because you've got the whole headset in place it's not going to bounce and even if it does it's being picked up there at the moment you also get in it here at the moment you get the dual USB dual USB connector there at the moment so you can plug it into for example to a laptop and connect it there and again you've got the voice player which is just your 3.5 mil jack there at the moment and it plugs in so you can plug that in onto your phone so this part can plug into your phone there at the moment and you can have one coming out directly to it and you also get Depending on what you're connecting it into, you also get 6.35 mil um, adapter as well. So that just plugs in. So you just convert it. So it's not as if you're um, restricted in one particular option there. And you also get a couple of wind um, forms as well. Just spare ones there at the moment. Okay. Handy enough as well, you get the belt clip. So if you are going to actually be using it, on your presence, which would make sense. That plugs in here, you plug it on into your belt. And in essence, what you do is you plug this into your hair. One thing you also notice as well is very clearly, USB connector, just a charging, on off button here as well. So you can have the on off button. And on the other side, you see the volume down, volume up, so you can control the volume. So when you're actually talking, for example, um, you can control the volume up and down. On the receiver, you just got the USB because it's obviously charging, and you've got the on-off button. Plug and on, just a bit of a light so you know it's coming on. And again, plug and on. Typically in a lot of our equipment, what you'd have to do is you'd have to pair these. This is actually prepared already in advance, so that's a real bonus. You just plug it in, it actually works. Um, and you can use it for whatever you want to do it. Now, what I was also saying as well is when you're actually using it there at the moment is you can wear it around different options. You can use it with a smartphone or tablet there as well with the um, white clip. You can actually plug it into a laptop and connect it up so you can transmit. So if you're recording a presentation, for example, you can do that there. One thing to be aware of though, if you're plugging it into a, an external device, you need 
15 minimum of 15 watts of power so when you're plugging it into something so a quick example would be is this is plugging into a speaker standard speaker there at the moment from a known brand if this is a budget one there you can probably hear the noise because i have it um talking with it so this is plugged into your not recommended to keep that there so i'll put this over here and i'm going to put this on top on my um beside me or actually change it over to the yeah plug it into different options possibly recommended not to keep the speaker and the microphone all in the one place so what i've actually done now is i've actually plugged this into a speaker this is normally typically a pa for example booster there at the moment so if it, even a class type of thing once i walk around i'm actually going to deliberately walk outside the house walk around um, i'm going to keep talking the whole idea here at the moment is as the range 2.4 gig will actually tell you the quality there at the moment if for example um this is bluetooth once i step outside the front door i would lose the signal straight away i'd also lose the quality so as i walk here at the moment and i'm moving around and uh, just testing this at the moment it just shows the frequency the quality etc there further i move from the unit itself what you find is obviously distortion there at the moment and i'm actually i won't say jumping but i'm moving around a huge amount for a little bit of the distortion there at the moment with the distortion this is what you'd expect and um, you expect the noise in the background again and um, for it to actually go i have tested this earlier on on a phone smartphone traffic therapy it's quite a bit such a way what you probably find is the quality will start dropping the further distance disadvantage is i don't know if i can't hear the quality of the distance so if i'm at a far end of a, a field for example doing this it's not always sure unless the pa system i'm getting something as i walk back i have to be very careful in the sense that closer i get to this particular unit you hear the feedback not recommended but it wouldn't be but that's the same with any particular ones there so back in the room again and again we're going to get feedback once i start putting it through here not recommended as you would the one thing couple of things we do like on this particular unit is it's multi-purpose just move the speaker out of the way for a moment so i can actually put it in my head around so when i'm moving around no distortion jumping about i've shook i've danced moved around a lot putting this around it doesn't fall and you see the vibrations on your head there at the moment it doesn't you can hear the ticking when i do actually do that you can take this off and on as required if it's outdoor certainly it's a wind as a wind guard put it back on if it's indoor in a nice um presentation you don't actually need that for it itself and again if you see a lecturer for giving a presentation there at the moment that's more of your traditional type put it on your shirt uh, etc and obviously it comes off there at the moment is and obviously if you're plugging into a different situation there so i've been using this for a couple of weeks just trying it there seeing it haven't done any external presentations obviously for the current um climate that's going on but i have tried a few um trainings etc you do get an option one slight concern is there's so many accessories here at the moment there's so many accessories that i'm going to have half them lost within a couple of weeks this only used on certain occasions this is only used on certain occasions good for actually charging so at least i've got a charge in the options to plug it into a laptop or plug it into my standard charger to charge these particular devices it does take a couple of hours so if you are doing a presentation there the key things about that is the frequency um on off is just the on and off button and also obviously i can turn the volume up and down as i'm walking or talking so as i'm talking one two three four one two three four one two three four and we'll just do this again one two three four one two three four the volume actually does decrease uh, it's difficult because i have them side by side having them so close but as a standard pa you'd have the speaker system at the real end if you try and use it with a real budget speaker you probably won't work um etc on that and that's one thing to be very aware of overall it does what it says in the 10 it is actually a wireless microphone it does actually connect what i do like about it is the 
there's no working volumes. So you just plug them that into the OPA, that walk around with your microphone. So in sessions, it's very, very simple to use. You don't need to be a techie or anything of that nature to actually set it up. You've got the other buttons, the volumes up and down. That's just standard enough there at the moment is there. Quality seems okay. Slight concern on the amount of accessories, how you don't get a, I won't say a bag or a protective cover there at the moment. So for me personally, I probably could end up losing them, especially if this is going to be out and about in your training, for example, or giving these um, demo lives. Um, Quality is good. Good to see you get a couple of spare wind clips as well, which there is a big difference when I have used it outside. Try talking there at the moment, testing this, and go back in, putting it back on there. There's a huge difference. 2.4 is obviously a great frequency to be on. And thank you very much for watching Tech Buzz Arms.